And now to the trial of Matthew Queen, the jury reaching a verdict today on the 35 charges against him in the case that's now known as the Bakersfield Three. 23 ABC's Mythley Gooby joins us now in the Live Center with a breakdown of today's court proceedings. Mythley. Queen was found guilty of murdering Michael Holsenbeck. In, in total, he was convicted on 24 out of 35 counts, including threatening with intent to terrorize, kidnapping, and possession of an assault rifle. Matthew Queen, guilty of felony to murder of Micah In the case of the Bakersfield Three, Matthew Queen was found guilty on a charge of second degree murder. And even though prosecutors were pushing for a first degree murder conviction, Holson Bake's parents say this is still justice for their son. It's murder. It's significant and it's murder. And we said that we would get him for that and we did. The trial began in early because, uh, April, about four years after Micah was reported missing, and the jury delivered the verdict Thursday afternoon. It has been difficult to uh, get all this evidence together. We had witnesses that came in from out of town. We had witnesses, expert witnesses, witnesses in custody, and so it has been difficult to get everyone here to provide the evidence, but I think well worth it, and ultimately uh, that's what the result shows. I don't want him hurting anybody else. We just want him locked up. I think we have successfully done that. Officials also elaborated on Queen's potential sentence, saying he could face decades or even life in prison. He has a prior strike offense that occurred back in 2008. Uh, second degree murder is 15 to life, so the judge within his discretion could make that 30 years to life. There are other victims of crimes out there he was found guilty of uh, against Megan Farmer, against Caleb Seiler. Those could add an additional well over a 10 years approximately, and then all the gun charges as well could add about another 10 years uh, to his sentence. At a briefing held by the Kern County District Attorney's Office after the verdict, Prosecutor Eric Smith says there is still a warrant in the system for Bailey Despot's arrest. Despot, who is still missing, was also charged in Holson Bake's death. So at this time, if she's found uh, alive, she would be arrested on these charges. Micah's parents say they are relieved with the jury's decision. We're just grateful that maybe the community can relax a little bit and, and um, he won't be coming back for quite a while. Queen was found not guilty on 11 counts, including torture and assault with a semi-automatic firearm on a person. His sentencing is scheduled for June 7th. At the Live Center, I'm Maitiligo B. 23 ABC, connecting you.